Hello, my name is Adredden, and we are in Seven Days to Die, True Survival, Alpha 16. So, in the last episode, we managed to find ourselves the Claw Hammer and the Cooking Grail. So, I've made a bunch of food. Uh, these, let's see here. I kind of don't want to get rid of them, but I can't cook. And, you know, I was actually very um, skeptical that there was even... Um, what are they called? The uh, blue spruces in the game, because uh, I spent a very long time in creative, like in my um, testing world and in creative mode, and just flying around looking for them. And it took me probably better part of 45 minutes, like jumping from biome to biome. So you need a pure winter biome, a pure one, to be able to find these things. So. If you're unlucky, you'll keep finding ones that are sort of mixture ones, which is not fantastic. Give you that much. All right, axe head mold. Let's do that. Hammer head mold. Let's do that one. Great. Turn that off. Come here, you. Great. So now we have our molds. Um, okay, I was wondering, I'm like, where are all my proteins and such? Um, I can't seem to break those down, so that's fine. Um, but I'm trying to still get rid of this dang bad diet, and so it's just kind of... kind of brutal. Quest complete. Make food servings. Alrighty. Okay. <laughs> well, that's awesome. Um, quest started learning to cook. Oh, neat. Let's take a look at that. Um, might be able to do some of these ones too, because I got a bunch of nails. But we'll be—I we'll get a whole ton when we're trying to get planks to learn how to make uh, normal building stuff. Uh, learning to farm. Yeah, so this was the brutal one because it was trying to find these is something so hard. Uh, I mean, I can get these ones pretty easy, but these are going to be tough. And this one. Animal hide need four. That's not too bad. Anyway, we're gonna do this quick because I'm still getting so hungry. Um, learning to cook. Learning to cook. Craft a food prep table. Well, you know that that's not actually necessarily too bad. Um, food prep table. Okay, well we're gonna have to wait a while, but we're gonna have our forge soon. Uh, we can probably make this soon. Those. This is this is within our near future. Okay. Um. So let's make a forge. Great. Um. Where do I have all my? I guess they're not in this room. They are. Being stored, I think, in one of these ones. Oh, I also wanted to make... Oh no, where did I put it just now? This one. Oh, I have one right there. thought I could make a screwdriver mold. Recipes. Screwdriver mold. Why couldn't I do that? That's kind of weird. So now we have... Pretty much all of our tools, except for this guy here. So let's try to get that one happening as well. Anyway, where the heck did I put all these? I know, it hurts. You shouldn't be in my house anyway, so... I'm not gonna be giving you too much sympathy on that one. Alright, that's it. Just get out of my inventory. I've had it with you. Um... Okay, so what about this? Recipes. I don't know it. So this probably comes from a uh, screwdriver, I would guess. Screwdriver here. Screwdriver head mold. Yes, window. I know that my processor is not supported at the moment. 15 points. I don't know. I don't... Is there anything else that I maybe need that uh, 
Other than that guy to finally die. It's like taking out everything downstairs. Barbed wire fences, actually. That could be a good one. I would have enough points to buy that as well. Woodworking bench. It's probably pretty good as well. Cement mixer. Yeah, see, we're starting to get, we're starting to get there. Oh, nails. I seriously, have to buy this? Okay. <laughs> it's gonna come in useful. Uh, so we're just gonna do it. Um, lower body assault rifles. So these ones, I don't know. Some point soon, I guess. But they're not crazy expensive. How many guys are down there? Spiked club. Blunt weapons five. Um, I really want to buy it, but I will wait. I will wait. Okay. Um, I don't know. There's probably other useful things to buy, but let's um, let's get some Iron Age things happening because. I kind of want to get this done. Oh my god, stop destroying stuff down there. Uh, yeah, let's do it like this. Wow, even just deliberating that much time, I've spent like 10 health. Okay, so we need some fuel. Okay, let's use some of these guys. Gives us a lot of time. Um, iron. Let's put that in there. Some of that. Oh, glass is smashing. That's probably bad. Stone. Uh, we don't want to put all of our stone in there because we need to make more axes and such. So, turn that on. Start generating that heat, shall we? <sighs> okay, um, so, okay, yeah, so there we go. Let's put in the hammerhead mold, and the axe ones. These are probably my first two quick ones that I need right away. Hammerhead, craft that sucker up. It's pro they're probably going to be, like, really bad quality at first, so I will probably need to make a bunch of them. Um, let's see, spearhead, spearhead mold required, anvil required, so I'm going to have to make another anvil and put it in here, that's okay. It's kind of nice having this because then now I don't have to like run up the hill to have to do all this stuff. They must have skills to do these ones, be my guess. Um, I'm hoping now that I'm starting to get a much better grasp on this uh, to do some more tutorials, because I know uh, there's very little out there. Eat, 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 eat. Okay, let's just let that go for a few minutes. Uh, I'm going to see about making a kebab in the... There we go. Cook that up. Turn that off. Eat that up in a moment. I'm actually pretty tempted to scrap this because then I could uh, eat it with some other things. Put the frying pan back in here. Get that out of there. Alright, let's, uh, let's eat this. And then... I guess we'll eat that. I might have to review again this diet thing, because I thought it was the case that if you eat different types of food in a row, you gotta, you know, you, you do better, but apparently it's not necessarily that way. Um, you know what? I don't know that it's good or bad, but I'm gonna make I'm gonna get the, the screwdriver skill because I would rather not lose my ability to make screwdrivers. 
Oh no, I have all my clay in the thing. Which is fine in some ways, but bad in other. Let's take that out of there. There we go. I mean, it's easy to get some more, but I'll have to go do that. Okay, there we go. Screwdriver head mold. Craft. Great, turn that off. Take this. There we go. I'm gonna need uh, my new container over there. Do I have? I thought I put. Let's make a pile of garbage. Kind of a weird way to <laughs> store your stuff that you actually need to declare it a pile of garbage. Let's put it here for now. And we'll put our mold in there. There we go. So, um. Kind of wondering why there's not the ability to do, say, an axe head mold. Axe. Okay. Um, so a hundred and five clay. It's funny because, like, I've always thought of the clay as being something you need to actually, you know, have the molds. So now we have molds. It's kind of defeats my mental um, purpose of having them, but. Uh, that's fine. Whatever. Uh, okay, so, um... It's actually knowledge that I'm missing to make these, so... I may have just screwed something up a bit. Um, so let's go axe. Oh, they're actually not that expensive. I'm not going to be doing as much mining immediately. Because uh, I'm going to need to do... I need to do the defenses here, so I'm going to need this. Why do these all look like they're requiring levels rather than just buying a simple thing here? Oh, jeez. Looking through some of this stuff is kind of annoying. Um... Oh. I'm not level 25. That's really weird. So I guess the hammer is its own thing? <laughs> Alright. I won't comment on that, but uh, let's turn this off. Let's just make a, a hammer for now. Recipes, claw hammer. I need glue. I have glue uh, somewhere. I think what I'll also do, guys, is between uh, this episode and maybe the next, I'll try to do a bunch of spikes downstairs, kind of like I've been doing, but I'll probably do it by myself, because, I mean, we really need another episode where I'm doing spikes. I personally don't think so. Okay, let's see how this goes. Recipes, claw hammer, craft, and 25 minutes, so, uh, level 15, so I should be having a lot higher level of, uh, skill according to some people and I don't know maybe it's because I went with like strict like you know the server settings that uh, have been mentioned by spider um, so I'm on like one hour days which can be kind of um, brutal yeah so this is what I thought one level of one so that's probably not gonna last very long it's got durability of a hundred which isn't great so, uh, there are only ten, so I could make, I don't know, nine more? Sure. They're pretty quick. Um, yeah, we have levels of things that are okay. Mm. I'm gonna have to maybe put this in my clay and other, like, useful things in there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
So we won't, we might be without a screwdriver for a little bit of time, but not, not for too, too long. Okay, so it is morning time. We, um, these are good for omelets. What do they scrap into? Safely be eaten uncooked or used in several recipes. And some tenderloin. What about just steak and mushrooms? I mean, that's good. That's quite tasty. I tried to make one of these, but I definitely could not. Herbal antibiotics. Uh, painkillers. You know what? I'm gonna actually save those for when I'm truly starving, though I'm not in good shape right now, but. And I have arrows, but I. Why do I have iron crossbow bolts? That's not useful to me at all right now. Um, I know, guys. Terrible use of my planks, but it's kind of irking me that this wall is damaged. Anyway, I'll be getting a lot more uh, when I go to town. Okay, good. I'm going to turn this off, because I don't think it needs to be on this whole time. I hope to get a chance to go over there maybe before Horde Night? I don't know. Boom. Recipes, claw hammer. I don't know. Let me know if you think this is a bad choice to be doing them in, like, you know, chunks of batches like that, because for all I know, it could be good to just make them last for a long time and whatnot. Okay, so we are going to go downstairs real quick, take a look at what damage has been done. Do I need to put anything else in here? Maybe this guy? Yeah, because I'm going to need to do these two together and shoot. Uh, healing? Hmm, healing would probably be better. Hey, and now we can upgrade actually the um, big log spikes too. That'll be good. So... But we would need more planks, so we're out of those. Uh, we are up to full health. Nobody in there, which is good. I'd rather approach the house from the outside. That way I am a little bit more aware of what's going on. Okay, just sort of looking for uh, anybody on the hills or any sort of wandering hordes, just so I know who's around, what I need to watch out for if I suddenly ambushed. Okay, I guess I'm all right. Oh, we can take down this. This is just a hay bale. I painted it to look like a pumpkin because it's sort of Halloween-esque. Okay, so then we can use our hammer to take this apart and get some planks. Yeah, see that doesn't last me very long. I didn't figure it would, so... Um, that's totally what I anticipate. But anyway, so we'll be tearing apart... Oh yeah, there we go. Many more of the buildings. Um, and whatnot. Uh, okay, you. Hopefully that got her. She sounds dead. Okay. Water. Nice. Maybe I didn't end up picking it up. All right. Um, actually do some repairs to this poor, poor house. All right. I do kind of expect this kind of stuff. Uh, probably do it this way. Continue to just <laughs> reinforce the house with random log parts. Oh, yikes.
eventually we'll have just a big weird log house. <laughs> so, which is fine, I guess. Um, you know what? I don't really want to take out anything like that. So, let's get some goodies. Put in another chunk of log. So this strategy seems to be working all right um, for holding the house up for now, but oh wow. Um, I mean, I don't know how long it's going to last. I don't know how much of this thing is being held up by like POI glue or what. Which is to say that it's basically just being he <laughs> held up by um, sort of physics that don't really match the game. Okay, so, so far the spike systems are kind of alright. Scrap. So this whole wall needs to be seriously reinforced. That's okay. Um, oh my goodness. Wow, I don't know how I'm going to fix that wall. Uh, but I'll, I don't know, we'll just keep trying. I mean, now that we've kind of got certain levels of abilities to make things, that's sort of what holds you back, I think, the most in this game is not the fact that you have or don't have things. Like, the cooking girl was a big pain in the neck, but not having the ability to, uh, make a forge and stuff sort of also a big thing to hold you back but if I can make a second cooking grill which I can't yet or if I find one you know then I can you know make a backup and put it somewhere else like if I I'd probably be pretty wise to make a secondary set of um, molds and then put them somewhere not in this house just in case this house collapses but we'll see how resources and boredom go I mean so far I, I don't generally abhorred in true survival and if you do you're probably doing it wrong <laughs> and then like I don't know I guess maybe you're not playing it uh, risky enough it's tough to say it, it's very complex that question so I'm sorry if I offended anybody but you know it's it's uh you gotta get out there and you gotta gotta work on it, so please don't collapse the house. Let's just take out one at a time. Oh, this has also fallen down. Can we put this into complex rotation and put them sideways? Apparently not. Oh, there we go. And I will have a weird <laughs> log floor too. Yikes. Terrible house. Yeah, we'll take both of them out. Oh no, I only have one. Uh, okay, copy rotation. Well, I guess we're going to do that. That way we can kind of support that a little bit more. Ooh boy. Okay, um, so it looks like I need to go chop some trees down and put more spikes in place. Well, um, I think I'm going to put more spikes in place. I think I'm going to make this episode a bit shorter because this is what I'm going to do right now. Just put down spikes until I have to run out of here in fear. So, uh, if you guys enjoyed uh, or found this episode useful because I'm, you know, trying to make steel, or sorry, iron tools and sort of, you know, got a chance to see what sort of um, things are necessary for that, then... Right, but this is where it actually is. Okay, um, and hit that like button. And if you want to see more content about true survival uh, and or seven days to die, um, hit the subscribe button. Copy this. No, no, copy this one's rotation, please. Yeah, so I will see you guys in the next episode, and I hope you guys are enjoying your... Oh, Dang it. Get off of there. <sighs> Your true survival experiences. Okay. Bye-bye. Wow. This thing is far out.
Okay guys, just got an airdrop, but I'm really surrounded by some bad guys. Okay, what did we get? Oh, military stuff. Nice. Dynamite, fiber, cool. Not not actually totally great. But not too bad either. Okay. Anyways, bye-bye.